Hello, my name is Jonathan Phillips, and this is my um, YouTube video submission for PolySci. Um, for the, the political event that I decided to attend, um, I decided to go to a Howard County uh, Board of Ed meeting. Um, unfortunately, when I was there, I was asked not to film the proceedings live with my own equipment, um, uh, so that way I wouldn't disrupt any of the proceedings, but I was uh, able to find out that they do have a VOD available of the meeting online that you can watch. And I will include that link in the description so you can see the meeting and, and, and some of the stuff I was talking about. Um, and if you do look in the video, you can actually see uh, at certain times of the video up to the right, you can see me sitting there in the meeting. So uh, I, I was actually able to attend and uh, enjoy the meeting. So uh, I chose the Howard County Board of Ed because I grew up in the Howard County school system and my mom's a teacher. So I thought it would be kind of interesting to see the agenda at, at the Board of Ed meeting and, and try to like suss out what the different cultural ramifications of that meeting would be because it's sort of a, a less obvious facet of society, especially compared to some of the more um, broader views that we've studied in this class. So I thought it'd be interesting to kind of do more of a micro type investigation of the culture and see how that kind of came out. So basically I made a list of a few of the things that, at the meeting that I was kind of impressed with that, uh, and basically I'll talk about those and kind of what my impressions were as far as the cultural ramifications and that sort of thing. So um, the first thing, one of the first things they did at the meeting was they swore in a new member. And uh, I, I don't think that was a sig super significant event. I just thought it sort of reflected the sort of decorum of the meeting and, and the integrity and seriousness of it. Um, I think the cultural implication there was that they do take everything seriously. Um, that education in America and specifically in Howard County is an important topic so that so when they bring in a new member they basically want to make sure that that person is doing everything to the best of their abilities and that they um, take the job seriously. Um, so the second big thing in the meeting that they kind of had that I, one of the things I found most interesting was the public forum which is where they give um, citizens an opportunity to address the Board of Ed with any kind of concerns or any kind of thing they might be proud of or any, any basically any issue that they want to talk about. Now, um, before I get into the specific um, things that were brought up in the public forum at the meeting I attended, I just wanted to kind of touch on, on that kind of concept as a whole. I, I think the public forum is a, is a big indicator of sort of the cultural uh, value uh, or cultural relevance that it would have to, to American society. I think it indicates the culture in that um, in American society, which is based off a of democracy and kind of the idea that everybody's ideas are important, you know, you, the public uh, board of ed gives everybody a chance to speak or share their thoughts or, or have their voice heard, which is very indica uh, indicative of, you know, American society as a whole and, and the cultural of everybody getting a voice and a word in, in, in as far as the political proceedings. So I thought that was very... Uh, a very good indicator of what the culture, the sort of the cultural proceedings going on at that meeting were. So um, the first person and one of the probably the most significant thing considering the topic of this video I was very surprised was actually um, uh, an individual a woman and a man who were talking about a cultural exchange program taking place in Howard County in which a group of South Korean students come for a couple weeks and they learn um, from some English teachers in America and they also take all kinds of trips to different museums and, all, and points of interest in DC and Baltimore and that sort of thing. Which I thought was kind of cool because the topic of this video and a lot of the, of the subject matter of this class was based on ethnic diversity and, and culture and that sort of thing. So when you talk about a, a cultural type deal, this was like case in point, um, the culture of Howard County and the school system and that type of thing where um, the county is open to new experiences and they're open to sharing with other cultures. I think it's ind indicative of a school system and education system that definitely wants to spread out and do the best it can to, you know, increase the experiences of its students and just sort of be the best it can. I thought the cultural exchange program was a cool way of doing that. Um, uh, for the superintendent report, she talked about a reward. Um, given to a teacher who went out of their way to help students. Um, culture, I think this just indicates again that education is important in American culture. Um, obviously for this to be, this meeting to even be happening, education is important as of course not all countries would 